What's up guys, Shahibaz here. So the new exciting details about the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 in the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra and Xiaomi 14 Pro with Titan cluster and new ARM cores leaked on the network. A Twitter user has uncovered exciting details about the Qualcomm's promising mobile platform of 2024 which will power upcoming smartphone flagships like Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra and Xiaomi 14 Pro. In addition to an unusual cluster configuration with completely new ARM cores, Qualcomm apparently also does without 32-bit support in the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 processor. Qualcomm is likely to unveil the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 again in the fourth quarter of the year, but rumored to be even earlier than 2022. Potentially as early as the end of October, this increases the chances that the first flagships of 2024 will come onto the market in China as early as November 2023. All the Xiaomi 14 and the Xiaomi 14 Pro with the Samsung is likely to be the next with the Galaxy S24 and Galaxy S24 Ultra start the smartphone cycle. Completely new ARM cores on board. There have been already rumors and leaks about the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 processor, above all significantly more efficiency thanks to TSMC's N3e process and a significant increase in performance compared to the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 are expected. And the Polish developer has now confirmed this via a Twitter profile page, some previous leaks as well as some new details. An unusual 2 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 cluster configuration has already been rumored several times, for which Insider has now discovered further evidence. Accordingly, this time all CPU cores are based on new ARM designs, which the chip manufacturer will probably officially present at Computex 2023 at the end of May. Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 with Titanium Cores The Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 code named Lanai or Pineapple by the way, the model number is SM8650, is said to be the first Qualcomm chip to use a titanium cluster, although it is still unclear what specifically differences it from the gold cores, more cache or higher clock rates would be possible. Pure 64-bit chip with Adreno 750 GPU According to this insider, an Adreno 750 known as Adreno Gen 7.9.0 GPU is also confirmed, which currently runs at 770 MHz, but this may change before the launch of the mobile platform. The new upcoming Qualcomm chip will run with the Lunex kernel 6.1 and Android 14 operating system and will be a pure 64-bit chip for the first time. That's it for now. For more updates, please subscribe to our channel Science & Knowledge. Until the next video, take care of yourself very well. Peace out.